Archbishop at Mass before Dodgers game, when God is insulted, it diminishes all of us. The Catholic religion is a religion of love. We believe that God is love, that He has opened His heart to reveal Himself to us in Jesus Christ, He said. Gomez said that Catholics share God's love not only in word and worship but also through acts of charity. We prove our love by working for peace and justice for every person. This is why so many of us are offended by the decision to honor a group that insults Jesus and mocks Catholic believers, Gomez remarked. Religious freedom and the respect for the beliefs of others are hallmarks of our nation. When God is insulted, when the beliefs of any of our neighbors are ridiculed, it diminishes all of us, he said. Gomez said that religious sisters, priests, deacons, lay Catholics, and consecrated people serve where there is suffering and a need for help. We are teachers and healers. We are advocates for those our society neglects, the poor, the homeless, the prisoner, the unborn, the immigrant, he said. We do this because we are Catholics and we are called to love with the heart of Jesus, he said. At every turn in his earthly life, Jesus rejected the temptation to violence. When one of his disciples raised his sword to fight for him, Jesus said, No more of this, he said. Gomez said that Jesus is meek and humble of heart and gave his church permission to proclaim the good news of his love for every human heart to the ends of the earth, until the day he returns. Los Angeles Archbishop Jose Gomez celebrated a special mass on Friday ahead of an act of blasphemy scheduled to take place at Dodgers Stadium this evening. The mass, celebrated on the solemnity of the Sacred Heart of Jesus, marked the beginning of a day of prayer in reparation for the Los Angeles Dodgers' decision to honor a group that calls itself the Sisters of Perpetual Indulgence with a Community Hero Award. Many are calling the organization an anti-Catholic hate group for its lewd performances that profane holy symbols and its perverse parody of the Catholic Mass. My brothers and sisters in Christ, we gather together on the solemnity of the Sacred Heart of Jesus to celebrate the beauty of God's love and pray that our hearts might be conformed to His, which burns with love for all people, Gomez said in his homily at the 12.10 p.m. Mass, celebrated in the Cathedral of Our Lady of the Angels in Los Angeles. He also said that Jesus commands us to forgive those who trespass against us and to pray for those who persecute us. Jesus taught us to oppose what is wrong and support what is true and beautiful, he said. So today we ask him to give us the strength to do that, he said. At the end of the Mass, Gomez prayed the Litany of the Sacred Heart of Jesus with the attendees, a prayer that he, together with the U.S. bishops, asked all Catholics to pray in reparation for the act of blasphemy.